Mr. Hankin. Two things. First of all, you work for me. I was just on my Let way. Let me finish. As I was saying, you work for me, which means when I call you, you drop everything. You return my call or you will cease to work for me. Yes, sir, but you can see I don't I'm... care if you're holed up with Rita Hayworth. Understand? Yes, sir. Good. Now, what the hell you think you're doing with this trial? I'm trying to defend my client. Then why don't you defend him, for Christ's sake? Try to knock down the charges or say it was a crime of passion or figure out how you're going to cross-examine McNeil's witnesses instead of all this psychological coma crap that doesn't mean anything in a court of law. Sir, I think it does. As long as this is my case, I think that's yeah, the way well, I should enough, handle it. Fair enough, fair enough. I tried to talk reasonably to you, but you're not going for it, so... You're not handling this case anymore. Done. Mr. Hankin, they're printing my opening statement in over 250 newspapers across the country now. If you want to take me off of this case because you're afraid of taking on Alcatraz, that's your choice. But I'm just going to go to Jerry Houlihan and tell my side of the story. If you want to play hardball, sir, I'll play hardball, too. I'm trying to be your friend, James. Do you know who the warden of Alcatraz is? He is the most highly respected warden in this country dealing with the world's hardest criminals. If you try to make Humson look like a Nazi, they will eat you for breakfast. <laughs>